Shay here. Today we're going to be talking about Mermaids and Magic and I wanted to show you guys um, the painting that I'm going to be working on for the event and just kind of cover a few details and after this we've got a giveaway announcement, okay? A few days ago I did a video, an un Untubing Tuesday with Craftably paintings and I'm giving away one of the dragon paintings so you can uh, participate in the event. So that's going to be coming up right after this so don't go away. Um, okay, so let's cover this. Now, I know, I apologize, I already have um, it sectioned off with washi tape, which by the way, this is my very ever, my very first time ever to use washi tape to section off. I wanted to try it. I saw some folks at the retreat doing it and Cindy Stevens is like, you can do it, it's easy. I'm like, okay. Um, normally I just use washi tape along the edges for the little bit of sticky that comes over. But I really, cause I normally use release papers, but I really like being able to see the painting you know, still, you know, after you're working, you know, while you're working on it. So, um, yes. So I, the one thing I don't have yet, I don't have one of those little cutters, those little blades. So that makes me really nervous. But once she showed me how tiny the blade was at the retreat, I was like, okay. Cause I think I kept thinking that it was a really big, like exacto knife and it was going to cut my painting. So that's why I kind of stayed away from sectioning off. And you can tell my sections are not even, you've got a small one here, a bigger one here. I just kind of eyeballed it. And just, but I have mermaid washi tape. Can y'all see that? It's from Simply Gilded and it was gifted to me from Sandra West. So I've been dying to use this. Okay, so this painting comes to us from Australia. The artist's name is Jazz Higgins. And this comes directly, it's licensed artwork obviously because it comes directly from her studio. She is in Brisbane, um, Australia. And I've had this for a while and it's one of those paintings I just was trying to find the right time and I thought this could be the time. I wanted to do something different uh, than maybe some others and I wanted to do something a little bit smaller because one of the weeks in March I'm gonna be on vacation and I won't be able to diamond paint. So I wanted to do something that was manageable. So let's cover the painting. It's called Aquatic Mermaid and it is a 40 by 55 centimeters round and there's the thumbnail. So she's beautiful. She kind of reminds me of Jasmine Beckett Griffith, you know, the big eyed girls, but she's happy. She's got some squids, uh, a couple of fish, some flowers. I just loved her. Uh, there are 33 colors and I already have her kitted up as you can see over here because I'm ready to go for Mermaids and Magic. I'm so excited y'all. Um, and of course I'll link her down below. She does have other diamond paintings. I don't know what she has in stock right now, but she does do, um, other than just this one, she's got some other paintings. Um, but there she is, jazzhagans.com. And the drill field is very, very clear. You can see right there, look at her big green eyes. And there's no guide circles or training wheels. I love that. But yeah, very, very clear drill field. So, you know, I thought this was going to be manageable for the event because, you know, I'm going to be doing other things and I just thought, let's just do something, you know, that's not overwhelming. So I am going to be adding um, some ABs because it did not come with any ABs. Let me show you all the color palette. Look at the colors of this painting. Are those not fun, happy, just a little, I love this color. And what I did was I was being a little lazy. I didn't, I was going to get my sticker maker out and make a copy of this and make a sticker sheet, but I just decided to use labels. So I just labeled it one through 33. I was just excited y'all and I just wanted to do it quick. So I'm all kitted up, but like, again, it doesn't come with any ABs. So um, I talk about this a lot and I never really show y'all, but I bought this several months ago. I don't even know how long ago. I bought a round and I bought a square. See, this one says round. And it's just a selection of ABs. And it tells you right here on the sheet, so what I do is whenever I get a painting, I just go down the legend one by one and just see if I have any of those colors. And I did have a handful. So let's go ahead and look and see what I might use. I don't know yet, but I have 307, really fun yellow. Got 907, love that green. 791 I've used obviously a few times, so I'm not sure where that goes, but I have a little bit. 550 is really pretty purple. 3861 is that brown kind of taupe color. 702, oh, that's beautiful. And then 995. So I'll just kind of go along. And what I might even do is I normally will put a little dot with a Sharpie on the label on the side. And I'll just keep these right over here next to it. And that way, whenever I need that color, I'll say, oh, I have an AB in that color. Let's see if I want to use that there. So that's kind of my system. Uh, I did pick out a pen. 
thought this would be a really fun pen to use. This is from Diamond Pen Pal, and you can see it does have the flat edge, so it doesn't roll. And I've got my favorite, well, actually my favorite is a seven placer, but I put a nine in here. So I'm, I can always switch it out. And I've got just a single placer here. So that's the pen I'm gonna use. I might use other pens, maybe pink, or, but I just wanted at least pull this one out, have a pen ready. And then I'm using a shea tray, the pink and blue. I thought that would match. What else? So I think that's it for the painting. I am gonna go ahead and post this picture on our Instagram page. And the hashtag is hashtag mermaids and magic 2022. Don't forget the 2022, okay? And now that I've kitted this up, I wanna go ahead and take a picture. Now you can put your um, kidding, kidding up picture, your start photo on Instagram before March 1st. We just ask that you don't put any drills down until after midnight and you actually don't put your first drill down till March 1st, okay, which is on Tuesday. And today is Friday for me. So I've got a few days left, but I'm gonna go ahead and put this up because I'm ready to go. So let's talk a little bit about Mermaids and Magic. Oh, I don't wanna cover her up. Sorry, y'all, keep moving things around. Uh, we have so many exciting things happening this month. The first thing will be a kickoff video. You will see that on Tuesday, March 1st. Be sure and watch that kickoff video. We will be uh, showing all the prizes that were given to us from our sponsors and donations that were given to us by subscribers. So we'll show all those, and we're also gonna be kicking it off with our first giveaway. So what you'll do is you'll, you're gonna wanna watch Randy, you can call me Butter, you know, I'll have her down below. Of course, she's my, this is a Shea Butter production. So we're doing this together. She will be doing a video on the first, and so will I. And in both of those videos, we will be asking for a word. And in there, you need to comment in the comment section with that word. And then our whipping chats that we do, my whipping chats come out on Thursday and hers come out on Friday. So, so the turnaround time is gonna be pretty fast. Um, we're just gonna kick off our first giveaways. I will be doing international on Thursday, announcing that winner. And then Randy on Friday will be doing US, the US giveaway. So yes, y'all. So be sure and listen to that kickoff video and watch all the whipping chats. And then again, I'll cover all the sponsors. I'll show you the prizes. We'll get into a little more details when we do that kickoff video. I just wanted to reveal um, and show y'all what painting I was gonna be working on. All right, y'all ready to find out who won the dragon? I am. All right, so what I've done is I went ahead and pulled up on my computer the random comment picker. Okay, so I've got everything set in there. Let me show y'all the painting. In case you didn't catch that video, hopefully you did and you, you gave me your answer if you were interested in winning this. I'm gonna be giving away Darling Draggling 5. Now again, this is from Craftably and they are currently out of stock. So I thought this would be really fun and it fits Mermaids and Magic, so it has a dragon and it is by Jasmine Beckett Griffith, okay? So um, I like I said, this goes out today and I'll be shipping it out on Saturday and that way hopefully you will get it in time to participate in Mermaids and Magic. Okay, so let me bring this up for y'all to see. I did put, oh, it's saying my battery's low. That's not good. I better do this quick or plug it in. Let me grab my plug. Hold on, y'all. Okay, I got my plug. All right, we're back in business. All right, so what I did was I put the URL of that Untubing, Untubing Tuesday right there. And I put, you know, filter duplicate users and then based on a specific text. I asked y'all to put the word dragon in the comments, all right? And get YouTube comments. Look like there was 64 unique comments. All right, y'all, you ready? Okay, we're gonna start the raffle and pick a random winner. And go. Victoria Wasden or Wasden, I hope I'm saying that correct. She said, Dragon, I just started diamond painting January 22nd of 2022. I'm on my second painting now, but would love to join your March event. Oh, y'all, that's awesome. She's a newbie. That's perfect. She probably doesn't have a Craftably or a JBG yet. I'm so glad you won. Congratulations, Victoria. That is awesome. You just started a few months ago. So, yes, contact me. Um, my email is in the description of this video. Send me an email with your address and I will ship it out to you ASAP, all right? 
Okay, y'all, that's gonna be it for this video. If you have any questions about the event, I'll link the, um, the announcement video in the description. And of course, just be looking out for the kickoff, but we're ready for y'all. We can't wait for the event. Randy and I are very, very excited and just can't wait for the month of March. So if y'all enjoyed this, give me a thumbs up. And if you've already subscribed, thank you for subscribing. If you haven't yet, it's free. There's a subscribe button down below. It just lets me know you like what I'm doing here. So click on that. And then there's a notification bell right next to that. Click on that. And then you'll be notified whenever I post up any new videos. All right. Okay, y'all, that's it for now. Um, I love you. Take care. And I'll see you in the next one. Okay. Bye, guys.